What's up, everyone? With those Jaguars yesterday. Figured if Dustin can start his videos of talking about his shitty football team, I get a chance to talk about mine. Beat the Texans. Texans and Titans are the two teams I always want to beat. It's actually my second take. The first one was interrupted by the video of the two Gator football players blocking each other, which made me laugh. Anyways, I want to do an update on uh, my 60F. After talking to Dave, he uh, recommended adding a filter. I was going to kind of go, I went up to the store looking for just kind of a hang on the back filter or something like that. Just kind of get something circulating in here. It uh, wouldn't be ideal with the CO2, but uh, anyways, I walk in there and Petco had the Zoomed. 511 it's rated for they have it rated for 30 to or 10 to 30 gallons it's uh checked it out it actually seemed like it was would be a pretty decent filter for this tank it has the option to increase and decrease the flow i have it turned down a little bit since it's a small tank but i'll show you the filter it's pretty simple. It's got a uh, first first chamber is where it come where the where it comes in at and uh, has kind of uh, two two chambers of sponge filters. Then it kind of has a recirculation area. I think it goes up like this, where it'll come up through and then goes out that way. But this is kind of uh, what I did here is this is um, like the ceramic rings that most filters have and came with some uh, carbon, but I don't usually run carbon in my tanks. Uh, I'm using RO water on this tank, so it's pretty clear as is. But uh, So I put some bio balls in there. I just kind of have them rotating around, seeing what kind of filtration, what kind of movement's going through. Uh, need to figure out what I'm going to do with the cords, but uh, right now I have it kind of running in the front of the tank. It takes over here. Yeah, it takes it over there. I'm kind of pointing up just because I uh, don't want to disturb the bottom too much. I also have the 100 gallon an hour power head going back here. I know this is a lot of flow, but uh, I don't know. Most fresh water is lakes and rivers, so, or rivers rather than lakes, especially for small fish. I'll have to be selective on what I put in here. So far, everything looks alright. Doesn't seem like things are getting blown around too much. Puts a cool shimmer effect on the tank. See, I saw some purling in here earlier. So, I guess that's a good sign. Anyways, so I'm to do an update. Show you my new filter. Yeah, this filter was on sale for thirty nine ninety nine. It's one hundred and sixty gallons per hour. I uh, cut the intake tube down to pretty much as small as I can get it, but it fit. That was my main difficulty was finding something that would fit in a seven inch tall tank. But I don't know. Hopefully I'm going to let this grow in, since usually I'm the only one that looks at it, I'm probably not going to spend <laughs> a ton of money on glass pipes for my tank. If you're looking at that, you, I'm probably not doing a good job with the plants, so... Probably will invest in a new lily pipe, but... Not a lily pipe, but uh, a new diffuser for the CO2. 
because I think that's pretty ugly. But that works for now until everything starts getting rude and going off. Anyways, let me know what you think. It's a lot of flow in a little small tank, but we'll see what happens. Let's see. It's a live and learn hobby. But anyways, thanks for watching.